Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. How are you all doing? Um, it's really nice being back filming beauty things for you all again. I know it's been a bit hit and miss over the last month or so but I am back today with my beauty entries for May 2022 and it seems so long since I got all of this. It's been such a busy busy month. I've been on holiday, I've got my allotment, I've been away with my grandson. I seem to have done loads this May, more than what I've done in the last couple of years so it's been really really lovely, really busy. Um, but yeah it's nice to be back. I'm going to be trying to make a bit more of a conscious effort for time for filming but you know what it's like, life is busy but but um, yeah, I'm not abandoning you at all. I am going to be here, still do my videos and things like that. So today's video, as I say, is beauty entries. So this video is a video that I bring to you every month and I look at all the products that have come into my collection through beauty boxes, purchases, things that are gifted, etc. And then I'm going to film straight after this my beauty empties, but I'll upload that probably tomorrow or the day after by the end of the month. And it is a biggie because I haven't done my empties for, this will be... I think it's three months since I last did one. So I will add up all my numbers of what's coming in over the three months so we can see um, if I've got more coming into my collection or going out. I usually try and do my empties every month, but yeah, I've been slack. I've missed a couple. So I do, um, I'm trying really hard at getting my numbers down. I'm back on with my project panning and I just find by doing these videos, it's a really good way just to be mindful about in versus out. Now, I haven't had too many things come in this month. It's been a much quieter month. I am very fortunate. I do get sent lots and lots of things in PR, which is amazing. Um, but sometimes it's really overwhelming. And I did consider um, a couple of months ago whether I should give up some of my PR things. But I don't want to really, if I'm honest. I love getting products. I love trying new things. And I love sharing them with you all. So this month, we've got a recap of... We've got um, Glossy Box, Rocker Box, Discovered Beauty, Feel Unique. I've made a couple of purchases as well. And um, I just had a quick look. I was thinking, gosh, was this only this month that we got these? I'd forgotten all about them. And I never sort of tend to use the products that I get until I've done this video. And then they can go into my collection, get packed away. And then I can start using them and enjoying them. So I'm going to whiz the camera around. We're going to get the overhead shot and we'll sort everything into the different categories. I sort them into five categories. Skincare, hair care, beauty, skincare, hair care, body, makeup and miscellaneous. And then I do the same with my empties and it's really good at looking at each category um, by itself and comparing. Um, if you haven't seen these videos before, hello, I'm Marcia. If you're new to my channel, please do consider subscribing. Um, I do beauty things, but I also do crafty things gardening i've just got an allotment a couple of weeks ago so i would like to apologize in advance because we've been pulling brambles out my hands are ripped to shreds so if my hands do not look beauty guru worthy <laughs> that is why and um i've tried to scrub my nails as best i can if there's any little bits of mud i know it's fine um apologies in advance so let's whiz around and start sorting these things out Please know I put makeup on for you today. Consider yourself honoured. <laughs> Let's get cracking. Firstly, apologies for this light. It is super sunny um, and the sun's coming through the blinds. I'm just trying to see if I can... Oh, that might be a bit better like that. Okay, we'll do that way so it's not bouncing in. So the lighting quality might not be great. I haven't got my lights on and yeah, I'm just trying to do a bit more like... Filming with normal daylight, I think it's better, really. Let me bring you up. Yeah, that's kind of going to work, isn't it? That's fine. So, yeah, I usually sort of start off sharing the beauty boxes and things and the recap of that. But let's start off with a couple of purchases that I made this month. So the first one was in preparation for my holiday. I thought I'd get a bit of colour on my legs. And I just got this gradual tanner. Um from Nivea and I had used it a few days before we went I have to say I didn't really notice any difference at all and um, so I have I just haven't been using it since but um, I'll bob it in and I'll pull it out at some point when I need to do it maybe bring it into a project or something so yeah it's the, the Nivea gradual tan moisturizer firming and radiance Um, fair to medium maybe I should have got the medium to dark but yeah I didn't know it's a great deal with that but I'll pop that into body and then do you remember a couple of months ago I got a um, Natasha Denona mini Bieber palette. 
absolutely loved it loved the formula so i thought i would go on and treat myself to another and i use my vouchers that i um save up for from my um pick and mix which i'll talk about in a minute so obviously if you use your pick and mix you get a voucher to get your 3.95 back you can save them bank them and use them together plus i've got natasha denona as one of my named brands so you can save 10 percent on that as well and what else oh and this was on offer as well anyway i ended up being able to get this natasha denona <laughs> mini retro palette for four pounds i think they're normally 22 pounds so by the time i got the discount the sale and um all my discount codes on i got that i'm so so happy i think i had like a, a it's got a five pound voucher as well when, when you spend so much you get like a a voucher added into your account as well so i had quite a lot saved up to bank so yeah four pounds it's absolutely beautiful um formula's gorgeous so i just wanted little palettes to take on holiday they're so travel friendly look at the size of them and um, so i took my mini bieber palette and i took this one on holiday and between the two palettes it did me for the full week and it's just stunning oh let me just i'm going to do a quick, couple of quick swatches i know that's not what this is for it's my entries but i just need to just show you i mean look her formulas are gorgeous oh, they are just so pretty it's a really lovely neutrally palette the shimmers are to die for so yeah bargain of the month i'm delighted so if you do shop and feel unique if you get your pick and mix make sure you use your um your codes before they expire i think they have about a two or three month maybe a three month um expiry date beautiful bit of makeup there right let's get into the boxes oh i've got my feel unique so we'll move on to feel unique first so yeah this is my pick and mix I think I'm maybe due to make another selection actually, so I'm gonna go on and have a little look and see what we can get. So Pick and Mix is fab because um, you can choose five samples for free. You only pay $3.95 postage, and then you get that back, as I say, as a voucher. And so technically these are now free because I've started using my vouchers all the time. I'm really, really good. So the things I've selected, I got a Shoe Umura, Shoe Umura um, what is this? A universal balm hair and skin camellia oil. So that'd be quite nice to try. I'll pop it in with the hair products though, I think. Um, I've got another hair thing here. Some bed head, curls, rock amplifier. Um, cool. Um, just a little face mask from Corez. Um, probiotic super dust face mask. I think I've got one of these already. Maybe in a tube. It looks kind of familiar um skincare let's pop that there um bright eyes dark circle radiance concentrate i do get um quite dark circles under my eyes so i'm looking forward to trying that one and then declare how lovely is this um essential oil serum four meals but look that beautiful and it's such an expensive brand Declior and you get that size in a normal beauty box so the fact that I've got that here is superb some more skincare all right then next box is Discover Beauty and um, give you a little sort of reminder what was inside so I do get sent this in PR I have got a discount code which is LMB15 so LMB15 that'll get you 15% off your first box it, honestly this is like my favorite box ever and um, discovered beauty i think they're amazing look at that so let's sit it down here and another reminder so can two i think was like the featured brand this month um we've got some beautiful products and honestly they're amazing i was going to take them on holiday but i didn't they're quite weighty so i'm just going to um start working on them very very soon and um, so this was a shea butter body cream absolutely gorgeous i tried them in the video i have got unboxing videos for all of these so if you want to see anything about that do go and have a look at that um they're in my playlist i've got i've got a generalized beauty box playlist and then i have individual playlists for each particular box like for discovered beauty rocker box glossy box birch box etc etc um yeah so beautiful beautiful body there we go 
And then this one was also gorgeous from Cantu and it was the Shea Butter Enriched Butter and Vitamin E Body Lotion. Love it because it's pump. Look at the size of these things here. 473 mils is massive, really heavy. Again, gorgeous. And then this, um, continuing on um, with the range, is the Shea Butter and Coconut Oil Head to Toe Moisture. And it is the Raw Blend um, Cocoa Butter. And it is just, I've left it sealed actually. Did I not, did I not try it? No. So I'll leave that one sealed, but I bet you it is just stunning. I cannot wait to use it. Um, also from Discovered Beauty was this absolutely gorgeous Cinnamon Moon English Picnic um, Natural Wax, the Soya Wax Candle. How gorgeous is that? And it's one of the ones with the wick, um, with the wood wick. Metal tin, really, really gorgeous. So that goes into a miscellaneous. Cannot wait to burn that. It smells so beautiful. It's like a florally, citrusy, fruity blend. It's just gorgeous. Um, then there was a vitamin C eye cream. Hurrah! So that should be nice and brightening as well. But they're having vitamin C. So looking forward to trying that one. I love an eye cream. We've got the Bay Botanique. Rose Renew Facial Oil, anti-aging, so perfect for me. Um, and I love rose oils as well. So look at that, gorgeous. It's in like an airless pump, really nice. So yeah, go check out my video if you want to see a little bit more about it and the talk and about the descriptions and the prices, etc. the RRPs. Got loads of skincare, no hair care yet, apart from the stuff I got from my Feel Unique. And then finally, from Discovered Beauty, was this absolutely gorgeous looking Mystic Forest palette from Estate. Uh, the colour's gorgeous. To me, they look, they look quite autumnal colours, but I'm, I'm okay with that. It looks really, really pretty. And there, to me, that says autumn. Um, I'm happily going to pack that away. Although I saw the oranges in that are nice and summer. Really good like base tones, everyday colours as well. A um, couple of shimmers. And then a lot of mattes as well in there. I think there's only three shimmery shades. And you can see I've swatched a couple. So if you want to see that, go check out the video. <laughs> yes, I like a broken record. Okay, so there we are. That's Discovered Beauty. Next was Rocker Box, and I was gifted this as well. Didn't expect to get this. I used to get regular boxes from Rocker. Now I just get them every once in the blue moon. So it's always a really nice surprise because I'm never like notified that they're going to be arriving. Um, and this is what we got. So it's like a real sort of like good sort of basic box. The theme was be kind. Um, so yeah, this was gifted. I did have a code. I don't think it works anymore, but you're welcome to try it. Um, it'll probably be listed down below in the description box, which would maybe get you 10% off. But I think since they did the price increases, I'm not sure that works anymore. Um, so the Ameliorate Foot Therapy Cream, which is really good. It's important to look after your feet, especially now it's getting to summer. Um, I'm currently working on a, a foot balm at the moment, but this will go into my collection and I'll be happy to try that very, very soon. Um, Ketaphil Gentle Cleanser. Um, yeah, just a bog standard one. Don't know if I've got one of these already. I'll maybe pass it on to somebody. Um, <laughs> funny story. I've, in my Fifty Shades of Green, I've got a Ketaphil product there. I thought it was a little cleanser. <laughs> it was only like a tiny tube, not much in it. Um, I've been using it and thought, this is so weird. Anyway, I've just discovered it's actually a moisturiser, not a cleanser, which is why it felt weird. But um, it's only helped me use it up. <laughs> it's like cheating. Um, next, we've got from Warder. I've not heard of this brand. A collagen skin lifter boost face moisturiser. I can't even remember seeing this when I did my unboxing. Isn't it funny? I think I, I don't know. I think I rushed a lot of my unboxings before because I was going on holiday and I wanted everything done but um there we go always nice to try a new brand um but yeah i've not tried anything by them before um looking forward to trying this actually um mono skin flash relax mask vitamin c and marine magnesium anti-aging um little pump again so it makes it really easy to use the only thing is 
you're not going to be able to see how much you've got left. It does my head in when you're trying to guess, especially for masks and things. Um, and so it's difficult, isn't it, to work out how much you need to use because you potentially could just leave a little bit in that isn't enough to do your final mask. But it looks nice. I've tried a couple of things from Monu Skin. Um, I like the Monu Skin rather than the um, some of the other Monu products but we've had some and like read a monu spa thing before which was like a lemon and something body butter and i really a body lotion i really really like that so yeah i'm looking forward to trying this gonna ramble on don't i um <laughs> uh, what else is there what's this from oh, Caprea. i've had a couple of things from these recently as well uh natura lash and i had a discussion it's a lash and brow serum about cross contamination i think i'll probably just do it as a um for my lashes i was worried about doing it on my brows then putting it back in the wand and then doing it on my lashes um so yeah i'm really distracted there's some little birds playing in my garden um <laughs> oh that's good it's just jumping on i think it, i've got some um i don't know if it's green i think i had some green fly my roses it's sat on my roses outside having a little um little feast keep eating birdie keep eating get those little bugs there we go <laughs> um okay so yeah we've got that so i'm looking forward to trying that is that that will go in skincare i suppose um yeah printer skin and then we've got a little freebie sample of some ellie saab perfume girl of now which is lovely um yeah i don't like getting little perfume samples i like trying different things um so that was rocker box so finally see there's not that much this month um which is good we have got glossy box perfectly imperfect is that just not me? <laughs> I am far from perfect. I never look put together on my videos. I'm always a bit disheveled and I don't know, never really prepared. So again, this is kindly gifted to me and part of the glossy circle. So I do get the glossy boxes each month. I have got a discount code, which is Lady Mawa. That will get you your first box for £10, including delivery. What a bargain. And glossy is just consistent, isn't it? It's a good mix of stuff. Um... So here we go. Let's see what we have. Oh, yeah, and this month, how fab. Look at that. Hello. Um, there is a little mirror inside. It's actually a really good quality mirror. You are beautiful. And it's got that in um, four different languages around the edge. So, yeah, I really, really like that. Um, I think it's good. So um, that was really cute. So I might actually put that over some command hooks somewhere. Um Let's see, I'd forgotten it had the mirror in. So we got some Grace and Stella, everything is better in pink, little collagen eye masks. These are like the full of serum. They probably slip straight off your face, but I do enjoy an eye mask, so I'll have one of those. My eyes have been a bit sort of tired and looking bad. Interestingly, when I was on holiday, um, I'm pretty sure my dark circles um, were much better. So I just need to retire and then um, spend my life on holiday <laughs> relaxing <laughs> so yeah a little bit of skincare there so i'm looking forward to trying them i've had a few things from grace and stella um but i don't think i've had the eye masks next is a product that i really do not like at all and it's the mine tan body skin exfoliant scrub these are coffee scrubs and they are so messy i just hate them um give me a sugar or a salt scrub any day these i just think of so i'm probably going to just pass this on to somebody that wants it but for me it's a big fat no but the people that like them that like that type of thing do say that they're very very good um then we've got this from deli concepts which is a daily round silicone scrubber um so you can use this on your body um to give yourself a bit of a buff so you just stick your finger in there, give your skin a bit of a buffer. I'm going to probably use this to clean brushes with, if I'm honest. But it feels fab. It'd be really easy to clean as well. I mean, I might try it on my skin, but um, I reckon it's going to end up as a brush cleaner. Whoops. So I'm going to put that into miscellaneous because obviously it's a tool and I don't count tools in my inventory because they're just like a natural wastage thing. Eventually, you, you just finish them off. It's not something you use like a beauty product and then you can see it go down it's just one of those things that you use and then when it's done it's done um we have got we're blushing oh sophia and mabel um a little blush stick so i do want to try and use cream blushes a bit more i've, I've never really been very successful with them but we're getting into the summer months now so it's definitely something that i can um 
give a go with now and then some balance meat bha exfoliating concentrate i think i've got one of these in my 50 shades of green project pan at the moment so i've got another one hmm. so i'll see what i think to the one that i'm using now um if i like it great i'll keep it It'd be ideal for travel if i don't then i'll probably pop it into a giveaway or something so yeah um skincare so that's everything so really not overwhelming at all so there were no hair care products in any of the beauty boxes that i got this month just the things that i have bought myself and then um a lot of skincare this month again and a few body things but it's mainly skincare which is really interesting um so i'm gonna go add everything up and then i'll be back in a minute oh guys i really think this is my best month ever i'm so happy and when you think that i have um often i'm really overwhelmed with beauty boxes and the products in them and because i've had three this month it is so much better and then bear in mind that i bought my got my feel unique and then my little purchase and that so like my feel unique was five things six seven eight which was on top of what i'd normally kind of get so let's look at numbers um i'm really really happy uh we have got three makeup items so obviously i brought this one in myself um another palette a little blusher so all things there i'm looking forward to using two miscellaneous items which actually won't go into my overall inventory um but yeah candle looks gorgeous and this will be useful it'll be functional for me like from a cleaning point of view skin 11 skincare products so happy to have like the lash sort of serum and um, i do have quite short lashes so i'll be interested to see if that makes a difference i do enjoy getting eye masks a couple of little things here to try i'm not too fussed about the balance of me um and i'll be interested to try a couple of these moisturizers the serums and the eye cream <laughs> it's pretty much everything not bothered about the caterpill um yeah skin care so body care um seven body care really looking forward to the Cantu range not fussed about the nibby that's probably going to sit there for ages foot cream is always nice to have don't want the coffee scrub nice to try a new perfume and then hair just two hair care products um interested to try this one actually with it being a hair and skin sort of balmy type thing i'll see how that goes and then the bed head i'm going to maybe have like a see i've got quite wavy hair so see if i just let it like dry naturally if that sort of adds anything into it so yeah total with everything is 25 products but we did deduct oh, da, 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 da. <laughs> we deduct the miscellaneous so i've got 23 products that's all um that just doesn't seem right but is it 23 i quite don't quite believe it 11 18 19 20. yeah 23 coming in when you think back some months i've had 70 odd so i feel so happy that um yeah I, I feel like the second half of this year is going to go so well um yeah that is fab for me if i just get that each month coming in that's amazing so i hope you have enjoyed my video if you have please do give me a big thumbs up and i would love it if you would consider subscribing if you haven't already for those of you that do subscribe thank you so much for your support you know i really really appreciate it and i'm a little bit behind replying to some of your comments so please do keep commenting i read them all and i will get around to replying to every single one of you thank you so much i love you all i really do take care enjoy the weekend enjoy the jubilee celebrations if you're in the uk oh a little queenie i can't believe it 70 years on the throne how fabulous is that i'm looking forward to having a big celebration later this week so take care guys and i'll speak to you all very very soon Mwah! bye for now